Years of hard work and dedication culminate on a magical May Sunday on Campanile Hill. 2013 University of Kansas School of Engineering graduates from all over the state. I'm from Fredonia, Kansas. Topeka, Kansas. This is Oxford, Kansas. Hawaii, Kansas. Kansas. Over Kansas. Manhattan, Kansas. I'm from Wichita, Kansas. The nation. St. Louis, Missouri. Detroit, Michigan. Henderson, Nevada. Baltimore, Maryland. And the world. Mumbai, India. Lima, Peru. Taiwan. Costa Rica. Put an exclamation point on their college careers. Plenty of credit goes to that special educator. My favorite professor is Dr. Paraj Nadar. Dr. Dapsik and Dr. Tempest. Dr. Shah Kashmiri. Professor Stiles. Joanne Browning. She, she was really cool. Dr. Lukey. Yeah, Macron or Darwin Parr. It's either Dr. Williams or Dr. Dedimore. They're just really easy to talk to and they're great teachers. Dr. David Peter and Dr. Shannon Blunt. They're both phenomenal. Dr. Scooter. Dr. Tagavi. A wide variety of classes help the graduates reach this point in their academic career. My favorite class had three material and energy balances with Professor Williams. Formula Car, Jayhawk Motorsports. A770 with Dr. Tagavi rocket propulsion. The circuits one with Dr. Peter. Heat transfer. CE 412 with Dr. Darwin. Concrete materials. Aircraft design because we did a lot with incorporating everything that I've learned so far through engineering. Tissue engineering with Dr. Dedimore. Not that it was all smooth sailing. The hardest class was a semiconductors course I took because it had you know some quantum mechanics and chemistry. Water resources. <laughs> AE 508 structures two. Probably electromagnetics. Steel design. The aircraft flight dynamics is actually was very, it was very difficult. Electricity and magnetism was really, really hard, mainly because you had to pass the final to pass the class. Plus an old favorite that always seems to be a real challenge for students. Hardest class is definitely process thermo. Thermodynamics. Process thermo. <laughs> Hardest class is process thermo. <laughs> definitely thermodynamics. Uh, I had to take it three times, but I finally passed. And obviously it's going to be, you know, thermo with Skirto. Process thermodynamics. <laughs> process thermo with Professor Skirto. <laughs> definitely process thermodynamics. <laughs> everyone would agree with that. But at least there are plenty of options to relieve the stress. The best way to take a break was to go to a basketball game for sure. Watch ridiculous YouTube videos and just hang out. To go get a nice coffee at Milton's in the Union. Running around from the one end of Learned Hallway to the other one, this is the longest one in socks. Really just hanging out with friends. I would just take a walk around campus. I would I'd leave my stuff in the library and just come out here to Potter Lake and just walk around and then that, that was the best way to refresh for me. Nap a lot. Sleep about 30 minutes and then come back. Take a nap on the floor of Spar Library. Sleep. <laughs> they move on to the next stage in their lives with many fond memories of their days on campus. My favorite memory is probably working in our senior design with our Jimmy V team. Going to the Ellen Fieldhouse, watching basketball games. The best thing ever. The entire freshman year. I just had such a great time meeting everybody. Going to Miles Street, hanging out with friends. Being able to get up and walk across the boulevard every day and just uh, appreciate the great campus that we have here. Going to Mass Street after we beat Ohio State to go to the national championship. Favorite memory, honestly, was just the time with friends, even though it might have been working over a homework assignment or something. It was just the time with the people that made this place special. And words of advice to the next generation of Jayhawk engineers. Find a group to study with and stick with them and enjoy it because it's a good time. Get to know your professors real well your first year because they're going to be your life support the rest of your time here. Get outside, have some fun, don't always just stick around in the engineering library. Figure out your place at the school. There's so much to do, so much to see. You just kind of got to figure out where your organization, where your group of people is. Work hard but also have a lot of fun and party hard because if you don't there's no way that you're going to make it through. It's a lot of hard work you know, from the beginning all the way through your senior year but just you know keep focused and get through it and you'll end up here uh, and finished up and, and ready to hit the real world. It'll be very hard but you guys will have to just stick to it because it's awesome. Study abroad and get a B. Grades are not everything so make sure you don't spend all of your time in spar or eat and get out there and have some fun and meet people because that's what you're going to remember when you graduate. Have fun, work hard, and just enjoy the time here because it goes by really quick.